All right, guys, I don't know why, but for some reason, I'm feeling extra tired today. But as promised, today we are playing Fears to Fathom Chapter 3, or Episode 3, Carson's House. Hopefully, while I'm recording this episode, uh, you know, the energy kicks in. Let's just, let's just pray. But if any of you guys want to see more videos like this, please leave a like on this video and subscribe. More horror content on the way. Okay, Fears to Fathom, Carson's House, Episode three episode playtime one hour i've committed to this you guys asked for it i'm gonna give it to you september 24th my name is noah i'm a 28 year old male from the midwest i have no idea why i'm sending this but i hope my story can be a lesson this happened to me when i was 18 so 10 years ago huh but i remember this incident like yesterday as the trauma dictated a major part of my life Oh, okay. Jumping straight into it, I see. Okay, let's see what happens. For a little background, my dad was a realtor and almost always became friends with his clients. I mean, you know, could be a good and a bad thing. One day, he came home and pitched me a small job offer for the weekend. One of his old clients was going away for a few days and needed someone he could trust to watch over his house. Ah... The man worked as a COO, COO, COO at a local media company. Dad told me the man would pay me $100 just to wash the house and do some basic chores. I accepted the offer as I had nothing interesting going for the weekend. Besides, I thought I could use the time to get my schoolwork done. Plus, I wasn't picky where my pocket money came from. My dad drove me to the house. Oh, okay. So... I'm at a laundromat right now. So I'm guessing I work at a laundromat, right? I need to change the settings on this. Notice, employees only. I got a bad feeling about this already. What the? I've never seen a laundromat this endless. What's at the end? Huh? What? What just happened to my vision? <laughs> Am I drunk? What was I smoking? Why are there... F Ugh, someone didn't take out the trash. I can kind of vibe with this music right now and... Hello? Sir? Doing some uh, laundry right now? Bleach? Uh, excuse me? Where did you put it? Uh... Where did I put what? Where's the bleach? I need bleach! What is this place? Who are you? I don't know what you're talking about. Yeah, what is this place? I said I need bleach! Oh, whoa, whoa, relax, man. Noah? Who the heck is Noah? Noah? Nap time's over. We're here. We're here. We're here. You said you could do this. Wake up now. Wake up, Noah. Noah, wake up. Oh, my name is Noah. This was like a dream or something. As I was on a car ride. I was like wondering why I was at a laundromat. Oh, there's my dad. You still think you can do this? How long did I doze off for? Doesn't matter. Can you do this now? Uh, I got this. Roy called and said the keys should be under the fake rock. Got it. I have a... What is this? I have a notebook. He said it's in the backyard. And like I said, keep the doors locked and don't open the door for anyone. I heard you in the first time, dad. Okay, now get your butt to work. I hope you know I'm only in it for the snacks. Okay, well, let's help out this person's house. His name was not Carson, that's for sure. It was a nice neighborhood. Had to get the key from the backyard. Oh, yeah, that's right. Dang, it's gonna look like I'm breaking in. Can I change the settings now? What? Evelyn Cooper. I just had the weirdest dream ever. I'm guessing Evelyn's like my girl or something. Fake rock. Gotta look for a fake rock. Backyard. Is that the fake rock? There's no way the rock's gonna be that small, right? Fake rock. Huh? Got a frisbee. What is this? Is that a... Hey, buddy. Oh, I don't want to wake him up. He might start biting me. 
I don't know guys strangers dogs like you, dogs you've never met in your life and you start touching them they're gonna bite you for sure where the heck is this fake rock I'm here to watch someone's house not get murdered why why is there really scary music hey buddy left mouse button to the pet oh you good boy good boy who's a good boy here, turn over. I'll, let, me, let me give you a tummy rub. Let me give you a tummy rub. Ooh, you're a good boy. Oh, is this the fake rock? Got it. I got the key. Now let's get into the house. There we go. Ah, very nice. Don't forget to close the door now. And now all I have to do is watch the house, right? This is a really big house. I had to pee. Okay, well, let's look for the bathroom then. This is definitely not the back. Whoa. Dang, this person has an entire studio. I mean, that is right. They do own like a media company, so that makes sense. Really lazy to model the garage. Okay, let's go find the bathroom. Is this the bathroom? Okay, well, let's pee. Let's close the door. All right. Really had to pee. <laughs> Let it out, buddy. Let it out. <laughs> He's leaking. He's straight leaking right now. Dang. How much do you need to pee, man? Oh my goodness. He's still going. All right. After that, we got to let's flush the toilet. There we go. Let's wash our hands. Uh, man, this person's dirty. He doesn't even wash his hands. Thanks for taking up the job, kid. I really appreciate you doing this. I'm sorry I had to leave early. Mr. Carson? Oh, that's his last name. Mr. Carson. Is he gonna re respond? My bad. It's Roy. Got this contact from Walter. Work is really getting the best of me here. Oh, no problem, Mr. Carson. Oh! For a second, I, I thought I couldn't trust him because he had an Android. But I think, I think we're all good. What is this? Someone's ashes? Oh. Oh. We got another text from Roy. I wouldn't have asked for anyone if it weren't for Zeke. Zeke? That's not my dad's name. Boy's been a little sick lately. Oh, I'll take care of him and the house. Now that I'm here, you have nothing to worry about, Mr. Carson. Oh, Zeke's his uh, little dog, I'm assuming. I was petting him just now. Oh, why do I get really creepy vibes, though? I just want to sit down. Oh. He just texted me three times? Wait, 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 whoa, whoa. It says, do not disturb for any reason. All right, well, you are a lifesaver, kid. Speaking of him, I wanted to remind you it's his dinner time. Could you get him his dog food from the basement? Right on it. Okay, this room right here is sketchy, but we gotta go and find the basement real quick. Gotta make sure I don't end up in the wrong room, you know? Where does this door lead to? Oh! <gasps> Oh, oh, that scared me. Okay, this is just the media room. So I'm assuming this. Oh, this is why I hate homes with basement. The basement was a little too dark. Yeah, <laughs> I'm scared. Is there like light or anything? Flashlight? We gotta look for dog food. I can't see a single thing right now. Almost forgot. I apologize for those lights in the basement. You can grab the flashlight in the storage room upstairs. It's no problem. Go get the flashlight. I realized the house was way bigger than ours. Yeah, this is a huge house. What the heck? It's all dark and scary. Mr. Carson's bedroom had this weird smell of wet clothes. Uh, you know what? I'm not even gonna. You know what? I don't want to explore. I don't want to explore. I'm scared. Wet clothes? That's disgusting. Couldn't open it from there. What's with this music? Huh? Mr. Carson's office looked like a good spot I could sit down and work at. Well, first... I, oh, I guess we are going to sit down. Oh, yeah, but I need to find. <laughs> I remember I was doing calculus that night. 
I did have schoolwork, but I wasn't feeling it at the time. Yeah, I mean, I need to get some dog food, but I just need to figure out where the uh, flashlight is. He said upstairs, right? Storage room. This is the storage room, right? Oh, nice. We got the flashlight. Let's go downstairs and grab the food. If there's any jump scares in this game, I am not ready for this. Oh, this is not, this is not fun. I'm not going to lie. Moving around in the darkness with the, uh, is that dog food? Okay. Let me look around just in case. Did I miss anything? Okay, let's go back to the backyard again. Get this little guy some food. Hey, little Zeke Zeke. You want some food, buddy? Had to pour it into the dog bowl. Open the- Oh my goodness, man. Alright, is this the can opener? Oh, there we go. Nice. Let's put this away. I think I'm gonna bring the flashlight with me. I don't know. I, I feel safer with the light on me. Okay, Zeke. You ready to eat, buddy? Oh. Hey, buddy. You wanna eat? Yeah, who's a good boy? Who's a good boy? Oh, cute little doggy. What kind of breed do you think this dog is? He looks like a Rottweiler. Little cute little Rottweiler. Hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. Mr. Carson just texted me. Hey, kid. Pro Heard from Walter you're a computer whiz, huh? I have a favor to ask. My computer has been acting weird lately and my whole security system is tied to it. Oh yeah, you got a whole security system set up here? Alright, let's start heading up to his uh, office again. End of the house. So we can't open that door, which is really, really weird. But it's fine. He deserves his privacy and... Wait a second. I wasn't even gonna try opening it. Okay, let's see what he says. Have a lot of expensive equipment laying around, so don't want anything happening to it. Yeah, I understand. I'll take a look at your computer. Okay. Let's sit down and try to fix his computer. He texted me again. Thanks, kid. Not a problem. Oh, your password, huh? Okay, I don't know how... Uh, what, what might his password be? Mr. Carson? Meow, meow. Meow. Meow, meow. Oh, I guess that didn't work. I thought it was going to be a lot easier than that, but it's okay. What about this one? Yeah, I don't know the password for this. He might tell me now. Ale oh. Ale Carson 5387. Okay, Ale Carson 5387. There we go. Nice. Welcome. Can't believe he can trust me with his password like that. Maybe he's a good guy. All right. Well, I got to figure out the security oh. system. The system has encountered a critical error. Egg.exe. So the oh. entire... Oh, wow. The entire computer does not work. Guide to being a what? Restore. I'm going to restore this too. So everything does not work. Free trial for a limited period. Your children catch cold. Your computer catch viruses. Get full protection. Now nah, let's open this up right here. Guide to being a better person. Talk and talk. Directed by Alec Carson. In this video, we will be covering how to talk like a better person. Feel free to take a break when needed. What? I can't believe people actually need, like, tutorials for this. Don't be rude. I thought that was obvious. Being rude will... Whoa, whoa, whoa. What's happening to the footage? Yo? Is it because I restored it from the recycle bin? Sorry, it appears that something is wrong with the broadcast. In the meantime, enjoy some happy images. Oh, cute little doggy. I hope something crazy isn't going to pop up. What? Wait, can I go back? No, I can't remain calm in any conversation. Where the heck did his eyes go? I'm getting scared watching this. 
Yo, I think they're trying to hypnotize me. I don't want I don't want to watch. I'm not going to look. Now, even though what he said was controversial, did you stay calm? The secret to being calm is to not let your feelings interfere with the conversation. Being calm makes you a better person. That's all we have for today. I don't know. There's a little bit left in the video. Guide to being a better person. We got all these people. D is nuts. <laughs> I don't know if you guys saw that or not, but. Okay. Interesting. I'm going to play it again. I swear I saw something. I'm going to pause it at the right time. His face. Something happened to his face. All right. So the video is playing. Once he shows his face, I'm going to pause it. Little by little. Step one. Don't be rude. Before the interference happened. I'm going to keep pausing it. Maybe this is a bad idea. Maybe I shouldn't be doing this. Oh my gosh. He had some creepy, creepy like eyes or something. Can't open anything on this. System still error. Get full protection. All right, let's just download random stuff, you know? See what happens to the computer. Maybe he, maybe he does have like a virus on his computer. That's probably why nothing wants to open up, you know? Let's download this. Perform full scan. All right, this computer is definitely a very old machine. Threats found. Oh no, this, this man got many threats on his computer. What, what has he been doing on his computer uh -oh. that? Uh oh, security threat high. Remove, remove, remove. Antivirus 96. Let's try figuring this out. Done. You're protected. Nice. Does that mean I can use stuff now? Oh, I can. Oh, no. Guys, I don't know why. I don't know why, but this reminds me of a uh, uh, observation duty. I don't like this. I don't like this, dude. Okay. Well, I fixed this security footage thing uh, system. Tell that to my kid. But thanks. Oh, it was just some Trojan. I recommend you only download softwares from trusted websites. Tell that to my kid. But thanks. I'll drop you a nice tip when I get back. Thank you. Thanks, man. Well, I should probably do some homework. Oh, I wasn't feeling it. Evelyn. Co Wait, you know what? Before before I read my girlfriend's text, uh, I'm going to close this door because I do not feel safe. Can I lock this door too? All right. Let's see what my girl said. Ooh, what was it about? Weird dreams remind me of cooking with Jeffrey on channel 10 last night. By the way, the rerun must be on right now. You got to watch it with me. Wait, that place got a TV? Haha. <laughs> yeah, hold on. I didn't want to go downstairs. That, that That's the issue here, but... Well, uh, whatever my girl wants, I guess. All right, so he does have security cameras all around the house that I did not even realize he had until he mentioned it. Okay, well, he does have a TV. Mr. Carson does have a TV. What the? Ew, what kind of stuff does Evelyn watch? We gift we. Cat food? It's on, are you watching? Cat food? This is kind of weird. It's my favorite dish. <laughs> She's acting weird. I don't like this. Evelyn. It's raw. So first, we are going to gently pour the cat food onto this I don't like what I'm watching. You know, you know what? When people say they like what they're seeing, I don't understand what I'm seeing right now. Sizzle, sizzle, fry the cat food. Cat food itself is already disgusting. Like, what's it gonna do when you fry it? Jeffrey, really just be Jeffrey sometimes. That's probably why I don't like watching Jeffrey. She's like, want to do this with me? Cardboard, glass, and milk. Who is this? Is this handsome Squidward? Next, we dip the 
cardboard into the mill. Ugh. You know what? I don't even want to watch this anymore. Look at that. Also, I think you should get uh the groceries before it gets too dark. There's some cash in my nightstand. What? Oh, I'm on it, Mr. Carson. Why do I have to get groceries for him? Okay. We gotta get all this stuff. Okay, well I'm I'm done watching Mr. Jeffrey. Let's go into his room and go to his nightstand, grab some cash. Wait, what? Ugh, God, I hate these. Oh, that that came from the TV. It scared me for a second. All right, so is this Mr. Carson's room or that must be a guest room? Oh, here we go. Let's go to his nightstand, grab some cash. There we go. I think I'm gonna turn off the TV because this TV is kind of disturbing me. Okay. For your trouble, get something for yourself as well as it's on the house. Thanks, man. Okay, how am I gonna get there? That's the real question. Wait. Oh, okay. This is the back door. Had me scared for a second. You can take Alex's bike. It's outside the garage. Okay, first time going through the garage this time. Where's the garage? Oh, I think it's over here. Rail was too lazy to model the garage. What? Okay, well, I guess we're going from in front of the house. Hey, there's a delivery truck. What? It's outside the garage. I don't see it. It's outside the garage. Oh, there it is. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, you could have at least modeled the garage. It wouldn't have taken that much time now. Alright, let's go to the grocery store. Well, where is it? I hope I'm going the right way. They didn't give me a map or anything? How am I gonna get to the grocery store? I don't know where I'm going. Oh, I guess that works. I don't think it mattered which way I went. 9.22 p.m. Oh, there it is. There's the grocery store. All right, let me try to swerve in front of this car. All right, oh gosh, I almost died there. Okay, let's get off. Let's get some groceries. We're doing some side quests. Hello, sir. Hi, you doing good? Doing good, you? Doing good. Use a shopping basket. Oh yeah, let me grab a shopping basket real quick. This is a... Oh, there it is. Hey ma'am, how's it going? Okay, we need, uh, let's see, let's see what the groceries are. We need strawberry jelly. I'm guessing that's strawberry jelly. Uh, ranch. Okay, we got some ranch. Chocolate spread for Alex. There we go. We got that. Milk and eggs. Um, let's grab some milk. <laughs> Where's the eggs at? <laughs> oh, there's the eggs. Let's grab some eggs. What are you doing? No. I, I have to get the... Uh, Evelyn, Evelyn keeps trying to watch stuff with me. Stop. <laughs> Evelyn's like, what are you doing? I'm over here getting groceries, okay? Eggs, okay. We got milk and eggs. Garden peas. Where are the garden peas at? Okay, I don't know which one is Uncle Tony's, to be honest. Uh, I'll grab, I'll grab whatever they have, honestly. Oh, there's Uncle Tony's. Uh, okay, let's grab Uncle Tony's rice. Huh? Hey, son, do you work here? Uh, I'm just here shopping. Haha, <laughs> okay, son. What is it? My son likes mustard. I came here looking for, but I can't find it for the life of me. Do you know where it is? Hold on, let me get it for you. Gotta do everything now, huh? 
Ah, oh, there's the mustard. Where'd she go? Where'd this old lady go? Oh my gosh, and speak of the devil. Turner and Andy? Oh, your girl was here. She just left. My girl? What was her name? Kara or something? Dude, I just said they're not dating anymore. Oh yeah, he hopped to that other chick so quick. I didn't even realize. Dang, I'm out here being a player? Oh no. Bro, she looks way older without makeup. Milf energy, bro. Ew, I think she's more like a goth. Goth milf energy. Are you guys done? Anyways, dude, what are you doing tonight? House sitting. You mean that Alex? He goes to school with my sister. Her kid's a real weirdo. Especially since his parents split up. Yeah, you guys have fun. Alright, dude. See you at the school on Monday then. Okay. Hey. Hey, lady. Oh, oops. Let me talk to her again. Is that her? Is that mustard in your basket? Could you get me one too? Uh, I was trying to give it to you, ma'am. Oh my goodness. I don't even need mustard myself. Okay, well, anyways. I don't even care anymore. <laughs> I'm gonna get the peas that I need. I don't know what it is about these VHS games, but they always get me motion sick for some reason. I don't know why. Is it because, oh, there's the garden peas. Uh, I need honey still. Gosh, get out of my way, you guys. I think it might be because of like, uh, how fast the movement is. These games are fun, but like, oh, there's the honey. There we go. Let me buy all this stuff. Should I build this for you? Yes, please. Thanks for shopping at Nux. Have a good one. Thank you. I don't feel like helping that lady. She didn't even want the mustard I gave her. Ungrateful. Ow. Ow. My dad never taught me how to ride a bike. You know, I don't remember the last time I rode a bike. I might have forgotten how to ride a bike at this point. 9.46 p.m. Oh, here it is. I had to pee again and I was starting to feel a little hungry around the time. And I still had a lot of homework to catch up on. Dang, Mr. Carson always making me do so many things. Okay, let's put this in the kitchen. Oh, he said I could bring myself some stuff too. Um, alright. You know what, screw it. I don't need to eat. Let's just go do my schoolwork. Wait. Oh, the camera's still on. Huh. Uh, let's check out the camera real quickly just because I'm curious, you know let's Look around see if there's anything suspicious Night mode. Ooh, I can see everything Let's turn on night mode for every single thing just so I can see every little detail where where did Zeke go? Where did the oh? He's in there. I thought I lost him Anything weird? Nah, I don't see anything weird. We should be good. Okay. Well, I should probably just uh, get to doing my homework now. I really just had to pee first. Dude, this guy is so high maintenance. I swear. Like... Like, why do you need to go pee so badly, man? All right, let me let me go pee for this guy real quick. Oh, this guy takes leaks forever. Oh my, is he spraying all over the toilet bowl? I hope I'm not missing the toilet bowl. I'm not doing the cleaning. I'm 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 sorry, but okay, there we go. Flush this toilet. This guy doesn't like washing his hands. All right, finally, let's do some schoolwork. Oh, and now I'm getting texts. Dude, you said you're at Carson's, right? You need to see this. Search up Roy Carson divorce on the internet right now. Huh? Uh, I don't know if I should be using his computer to look it up, but I guess I have no choice. Roy Carson divorce. Uh-oh. Roy Carson, co-founder of BN Media, claims to be receiving death threats from angry fans of his ex-wife. Uh-oh. Oh! His... His ex-wife was a actress or is an actress. They're famous? Wow. It's not uh, unusual for audience to be nosy, but sometimes it's overbearing. Okay. 
we see something s similar with the case of Roy Carson, the COO of and co-founder of BN Media. After his very public breakup and divorce with his wife, former actress Alyssa Brown has allegedly been rece receiving death threats from fans of Alyssa, Alyssa Brown for the rumored infidelity that underwent within the said relationship. Oh, who cheated? Oh, so he must have been the cheater. Or to say Roy Carson had been had had people knocking on his door to confront him. Alyssa hasn't been very vocal about the situation yet. Hunt, yet, but Hunter News is actively trying to reach out to her. What? Someone's at the front door? Yo, people are trying to kill this guy. Maybe that's why he wanted. Oh my gosh. Uh, may, maybe I should look at the security camera. There, there's motion. Front door. Front door. Oh my. Who the heck is this? Excuse me, sir. I'm not Roy Carson. Can you leave? Uh oh, what do I do? Yo, he's ringing the doorbell and everything. Uh, I feel like I shouldn't go and tell them off. Oh gosh, do I have to go tell them? So I can't do this, man. I'm going to get killed. They're going to think I'm Roy Carson. Oh no, I'm about to become a victim. All because this guy couldn't... Uh, this guy should have not... Have just not cheated, you know? It, it could have been as simple as that, but... He, he wanted to cheat. Who is it? Your delivery for one of your medium pizza. Oh, what delivery? I didn't order any pizza. Your one medium-sized pizza pepperoni pizza, sir. You must be at the wrong address. This is 224 Boulevard, right? Uh, should I just open it? I'm dead. Oh my. Oh, here. Take. Hey, this is probably a strange request, but... Do you think I can wait inside until the rain's over? It's probably not very safe to be out here right now, and I forgot my raincoat at- Nah, dude, you already- Nah, this is not my house. I'm, I'm gonna just let him know I'm not Roy Carson. I understand. You can just say no. Well, you have a good day. Alright, thanks, man. Alright. Huh. I didn't even order this, right? Well, I did say I was hungry, so... I guess I can eat this. Let's eat some, uh, some pizza. Thought I could watch some TV while eating. Okay. I was scared for a second, but you know, dude, this guy's never gonna get to uh, uh, his schoolwork at this point. <laughs> All right, let's eat some pizza. Mmm, pizza was nice and hot despite the rain. Yummy, yum, yum. Wait a second. Channel ten. You open a door for someone, and then what the heck is that? Yo, this is so creepy. Why am I even watching this? Spooks brought to you by Channel 10. I'm full. Look out for some pizzas. It should arrive at any minute now. Enjoy. Oh, he ordered it for me. Oh, I was so scared for a second. All right, thank you, Mr. Carson. Should I finish the entire pizza? I don't even know if I can finish an entire pizza. Maybe this guy can? This character? This is such a creepy show. Every, every show every show on this channel is so creepy from what it seems. Hope everything's okay. Dude, why does she keep texting me? Good night, Noah. Sorry, I got caught up with work. Good night, Eve. Sweet dreams. Oh, I mean, she just, she just really cares about me, I guess. But I'm just trying to watch this dude's house and like... Like, I'm, I might get killed tonight. I gotta watch for my life right now. I'm scared for my life right now. Maybe he should tell Evelyn about this, but, you know, don't want to worry the girl. Oh, I'm so full. I heard someone at the door again. I don't want to open up the door this time. Maybe I... Ah. Here, you know what? Instead of opening the door, I'm going upstairs real quick. I knew I heard a knock at the door. Nah, I, I'm not taking chances, guys. I should have closed the TV. <gasps> I should have. Now they know someone's inside the house. Oh no, goodness gracious. Okay, okay. 
Okay. Check the camera. Front door. Oh, wait. Are they going to the backyard? What the heck is that right there, though? Let me just turn off. And so I did. Okay. That's good, I guess. The thing is, like, I'm not trying to find out. Who is it? Yeah, I mean, they're not there anymore. I think I should open it. Who is it? I won't ask again. Yeah, there it is. Oh, close the door. What the heck? I didn't know what to make of it. It just left flowers? Yuck. I don't want no dang flowers. Okay, time to do schoolwork. Jeez. Unknown sender. Oh, hey, how are you? What did you have for dinner? Who sent this to me? I assumed it was the wrong number. It was strange, but I dismissed the thought as a weird coincidence and moved on. Yeah, that was a little bit strange. Besides, I had a lot of work to catch up. Thought I'd had that pizza first. Bro! I just have one slice left, man. Ugh, this dude is a big boy, huh? Gosh, how many slices of pizza do you need to eat, man? Oh, more TV? Let me just finish this pizza. Oh my, I was one of those people who, could, who couldn't just eat without watching TV. <laughs> oh, you're really grinding my gears right now, man. You had one slice left. There we go. This dude annoying me. Like, you ate it in a few seconds. You could have done that without TV. I promise you. Let me throw this away. Okay, finally. Let's do some schoolwork. Engrossment. Finally. Jeez. <laughs> we finally got the schoolwork. This was the first thing I was supposed to do. Okay. Did I fall asleep? 1.36 a.m. I was in the middle of my schoolwork. The power went off. Oh. Uh-oh. Unknown sender. Oh. Are you by yourself? Why do you keep ignoring me? Why are you always so mean to me? You're being very immature right now. Fine. If you're gonna be like that, I don't need you anyways. Todd is so much hotter anyways. Who are you? Uh, is it my ex-girlfriend? Or... Haha. <laughs> In that moment, I was almost certain it had to be another prank by Turner. Uh, dude, I don't know where the flashlight is anymore. I just knew guys like him very well. Beside him and Andy were the only people who I knew was house sitting alone. That is true. They were the only people I told about this. I think I'm just gonna sit, uh, just chill here. Oh wait, the power came back? What was the password? Ale Carson 5387. There we go. I remember the password. You tell me once it's over for you. Oh, wait, there's movement? What the? Where's the movement coming from? Yo, and how How did they know I was all, all alone by myself? Where's the front door? <gasps> Yo, I saw movement. I saw movement right here. Uh. Hey yo, hey yo, hey yo! I don't like this at all. Yo, they better not be in my house. That's for sure. Alright, my backyard is good, right? Okay. We should be fine. I think there's no more movement. I'm gonna close the door. I don't feel safe. They never texted me back. Uh, there's no more movement. Hmm. Oh, dude. Should I, should I check the front door? That's what they want me to do. Oh my God. I can't see anything. Mr. Carson apparently had a backup for a security system. Oh, so that's why the security system works still. Okay. Uh, where did I put my flashlight? 
Oh no, I can't see a thing. I don't like this at all. It was suddenly very cold outside. Uh, oh, there it is, there it is. There's the power. Uh, am I gonna get my power back? I turned the power back on. Okay, now let me look for my flashlight because I don't know where that is. I could tell that someone had cut the power off from outside. Well, I'd better lock all my doors. That's for sure. Oh, you said we'd stay friends. Turner, this is not funny. I know it's you. I had to get back to my schoolwork for Monday. Okay, well, before I do that, I gotta look for my flashlight. Where the heck did I throw my flashlight? Can't turn on any lights in any of these rooms either. I feel so useless without my flashlight. Anyways, I should just get back to my schoolwork. Uh, but before I do that, I'm gonna get distracted again. Oh my gosh, of course there's movement. Uh oh. Wait. Okay, I opened that door. Front door? Where did the movement come from? Wait. Why is there... Was there a light knock down here before? Yo, I don't think the media room was... I don't think the media room had its lights knocked down before. Okay, I'm gonna check downstairs. This might be the end of my life, guys. I might die. This might be the end for me. Well, let's quickly check up on the... Okay, why is everything knocked over? Yo. Someone's been inside the house. Hello? Is anyone in the house? The thing is, there's no security cameras inside the, the bathrooms. Which means they could be hiding inside the bathroom, right? Oh, he's not even going to try opening it. Uh, Do I go to the front yard? That's the only place I haven't gone to, but I'm going to check the security cameras again. I don't notice anything strange inside the house. But Zeke is gone. Zeke? Where did Zeke go? I swear Zeke better not have gone missing because I don't want it to be my fault. I'm not responsible. I'm not responsible for little Zeke. Zeke? What is this? Oh, there's, there's my flashlight. Oh, I'm glad I found the flashlight. Wait, oh, Zeke. Hey, buddy. Everything okay? Zeke was acting very weird. Uh-oh. Everything okay? You want to come into the house, buddy? Okay, at this point, I think I'm just going to go back upstairs and just finish my homework. Uh, don't know why I left the door open. Okay, okay, okay. I don't want to do this anymore. After, after I, I play this game. Nope, I'm done. I'm done house sitting, guys. Just let me do my homework. Yes, homework time. Finally. Seems like this guy is doing some pre-calc with all the wave graphs and stuff. Sine, cosine, tangent. I heard something downstairs. Oh no, I'm checking the cameras instead. Oh, what? There's movement downstairs? Or what happened? What the? I saw something moving right here outside. I swear on my life I didn't turn that oven on. They were inside my house. They're inside my house right now. Oh my gosh. No, no, no. Why do I have to go down and check? Why? I could just jump out the window right now and just dip. Oh no. The oven. I need a weapon or something in my hand. Yo, they're in my house. I turned it off. I saw something move outside. Yo, yo, you're not fooling me. Loki made me uncomfortable knowing he was in the house. Wait, they're in the house? I had to confront him. Uh, maybe I needed a weapon. I didn't have his contact. I can only ask Andy. 
Okay, I'm gonna text Andy. Dude, you said you're at the Carsons, right? You need to see this. Can you send me Turner's contact? Ask him to quit messing. Andy texted me. He messing with what? He's been snooping around the house. This isn't cool. What if he's like, no, I'm with I'm with Turner right now. Huh? Dude, he's at Oh my. I'm dead. I'm dead, guys. It's over for me. We were gonna go to the movies with Brady, but then it started pouring, so we stuck with the sleepover. Oh no. I attributed all of that to the lack of sleep. I don't know. I was aware I have the tendency of being overly paranoid. I think this is beyond being paranoid. The only logical thing that I could uh security monitor. Okay, I'm closing the door though. Can I do homework at least? Oh, okay. I should have called the cops. I mean, I still can. I feel like I should call the cops. But at the time, I was so engrossed in my own thoughts that... No. The idea never even entered my head. What? That should have been the first thing you do. Let's see what Andy says. Dude, wait. Did you check out the article? It was Brady who told me about it. Oh, this is real sketchy. Uh, what article? Yo, I swear I heard something. Uh, let me go back to the security camera. Oh, what the? The front door's open. I, I never opened it. I never opened it. What the? Yo, she's moving. She's upstairs right now. Yo, yo. I felt my heartbeat skip a bit. Uh, uh. She's outside right now. I froze and kept staring at the screen in pure horror. Should I keep looking? Oh my gosh. She's here, guys. She's here. I'm dead. She's right there, right outside. Oh my gosh. She has a knife in her hand. She was right outside the door to the room I was in. Oh my gosh. I thought my heart would, pro would pound right out my chest. What do I do? No, no! <sighs> Noah, are you in there? So that was the door. I really missed you. Whatever is happening between us, we can work it out together. What do you want? I've always been nothing but nice to you, but you're always treating me like garbage. You need help, Kara. Wait, that's my ex! I know everything. I know you left me for her. This is exactly why. At least she's not a junkie like you. Uh, it's different with her. But I love you. What about that? You need to leave right now. We deserve a second chance. You you know, I could turn you into the police for this. I'm dead. Do it and I will effing kill both of you. What the heck am I supposed to do? Yo, she about to kill me. How do I get out of here without dying? Oh gosh, dude. Is there a weapon? If I can't have you, no one can. Oh my gosh. She's gonna kill me, dude. I wasn't even gonna try opening it. No, there's no way. Can I get out of here? No, 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 no. no. Oh! Kara? Kara! Kara, please! Oh my gosh, I'm dead. Bro, is this what it feels like to get... <laughs> I don't know, I never want that to happen to me. What the heck? What the heck, dude? Was I meant to die like that? Bro, please don't tell me that's my fate. Oh, oh my god! Oh, oh. Okay, uh... Okay, I need, I, need, I need to run. I need to run. I need to run. I'm gonna go in here.
Go, 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 go. We can finally run. We can finally run. Please, please, please. I don't want to die. I don't want to die. Oh, did I make it out? I left the house and ran down the block. My dad called the cops. So by the time they arrived, she had already left the house. But I never knew where she lived. Oh, but I knew where she lived. Carol was one of the first people I met on a dating site. She was three years older than me, but I found her cute, so we started dating. However, two months into our relationship, she started doing hard drugs. Um, there, there's the answer. I tried to get her help, but she turned it down on me as if I was trying to change her. One day I had enough and I had to break up with her. I told her to leave and never contact me again. She was pissed. She was trying to convince one of the cops she didn't intend on doing anything wrong that night, but of course the cop wasn't buying it. They reviewed the footage and it showed everything. Oh, huge shout out to Mr. Carson's, uh, you know, security system from that point of her entry, the moment she grabbed the knife. But the things that messed with me the most was the fact that, that nothing was stolen from the house. Turns out she was heavily under the influence of the drug and alcohol at the time. She was arrested and sentenced for a long while. Oh, as long as I'm alive, you know, geez. Well then. All right, there was Fears to Fathom, Chapter 3. I know there's probably like a few chapters left. Wait, Cooking with Jeffrey VA was Berlizzi? Yo, shout out to Berlizzi, guys. One of the goats. Um, but hopefully you guys enjoyed this, uh, this video of me playing Episode 3 of Fears to Fathom. If you guys want to see me play more awesome games like this in the future, make sure you guys leave a like, subscribe, and huge shout outs to this creator. I'll leave the link to this game down below. Yeah. Love you guys. I'll see you guys in the, the next game. A <laughs> game by Rail. Rail who didn't want to model the, the garage. <laughs> yeah. Uh, let's see uh, how many chapters there are left. So there are two left in the saga. So looking forward to it. Hope you guys enjoyed. See you guys next time. Peace.